All right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how easy it can be to catch some gambusia, also known as the mosquito fish. I'm at a big retention pond in a uh, Walmart parking lot in Houston. And it looks like the Walmart parking lot feeds into this side of this retention pond and these neighborhoods over there feed the other side. Um, and as you see, as I'm walking this shoreline, it's kind of a cut bank right now where the bank that I'm walking on is about a foot above this sandy um, beach, beach line kind of deal. And that's not what you want. What you want is not a sandy beach area. You want an area where the vegetation is submerged right at the shoreline, kind of like right in front of me, and especially up here by that concrete. Uh, the mosquito fish like to hide in that vegetation. And so a lot of times, if you just go up to the vegetation and put your net up to it and shake your net, you can um, catch both um, gambusia and uh, ghost shrimp that way. And here's a great example of that. There's two ghost shrimp in here. Here's one decent sized little ghost shrimp. Get him back in there. Oop, number two jumped out. So that's kind of cool. But we're gonna head up, up to this uh, concrete deal here and we should be able to, uh, we should be able to get some mosquito fish off of this. So we're just gonna go up. A lot of times you can see them before you walk up if you look. But there's like a whole little school of them right here so just like that and there's a good i don't know eight to ten it looks like there's some pregnant females in there this is a super pregnant female here look at that look at that gravid spot on her it's a lot more pronounced on the other side see the black spot in the back i don't know if it's going to come up on camera but she's definitely uh she's definitely pregnant so we'll get her back in there and in that one scoop as you can see it looks like i got four five maybe six females and they're they all have various size gravid spots um which just means they're probably up in the shoreline here um having babies these uh gambusia or mosquito fish are uh, live bears so they actually have live babies and they don't lay eggs it's it's actually pretty cool I can see them all in this area. So anyways, they're super weary of uh, humans or any kind of predator approaching them from above the water. So it, it's a good idea to crouch down when, before you go to scoop them. I'm not doing, <laughs> doing that, but I'm not really here to get like maximum amount of mosquito fish. I'm just trying to show you for the purpose of this video um, that they're not hard to catch. There's a pretty cool looking snake right there. I don't know if I got him in the net. Did I? No. Where is he? That was a really cool looking snake. Wow. But look at these ghost shrimp. There's like a hundred ghost shrimp in here. It's pretty crazy. Try one more scoop of the net and see if we can get some gambusia or just ghost shrimp. No, nope, just a ton of ghost shrimp. Okay. And we got on that scoop looks like three of them and these are big females these are really big females i don't know where the males are but those are some big healthy females there so it can be just that easy so hopefully you uh, enjoyed that video i'm sure you uh, can do this if you can simply find a ditch or a waterway i know you can do something this easy so again thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.